morning guys, welcome to today's workout. The strength element we have got for you today is focused on wall climbs. So this is going to be good for those overhead movements, handstand push-ups and just general shoulder strength. We're going to go for three reps every minute for 10 minutes. We can scale these numbers down if we need to. And then afterwards we have a wall, it's going to be 100 press-ups for time. There's going to be an 8 minute time cap and every time you break we're going to do 10 single arm rows on each side. So to get nice and warm we're going to start with 4 walkouts. Make sure we're sending these hips back, hinging, getting into those hamstrings. Into that nice strong plank position. Walking up, and same again, nice hinge. Strong plank, don't let these hips drop. And nice and tall, we're going to go for 4 of those. And then we're going to go for 4 downward dog to upward dog. So, hips nice and high, letting his hips drop, chest nice and proud, hips high, heels down, and opening that chest, and we're then going to go for 10 mountain climbers, get his heart rate up, guys we're going to go for 4 rounds in total, that should get your heart rate nice and high. Once we've finished those, we're then going to go for your wall climbs, so with your wall climbs, have a wall, Need to make sure there's nothing in the way. We want nice, small steps when we're walking up. So we can start with our chest on the ground. In that almost press up position. From here, we get some nice, small steps of the wall. Trying to get as close as we can. And nice, small steps back. And the chest hit the ground. You see those reps take quite a while, we don't want to rush these reps and we want to make sure we have some rest. We don't want to be doing 10 minutes of wall climbs. A variation for those, if we find those a little bit tough, we can get into an up plank position. So nice and strong, we're going to go one, two, three, one way, and one, two, three, the other. That is going to be equivalent to one wall climb. You can as well alternate the movements. So if you're finding 10 rounds of wall climbs tough, you can do one round of wall climbs and then one round of like lateral plank walks. Once we've done those, we're going to get into our wall. So the wall is going to be 100 press-ups for time. You can do this off the toes or your knees. So from here, make sure that chest hits the ground. We want to make sure the hips and the shoulders leave the ground at the same time. So elbows nice and tucked in. Chest hits the ground, drive up. We don't want to get to the bottom and press and leave these hips down. We can also do these off of our knees. Same principle, knees, hips, shoulders in line, elbows in, nice, strong drive. You can as well put your sandbag on the ground, elevate those hands, and that gives you a few kind of intermediate variations. We're going to go for 100 reps, however every time we break, we're going to be doing single arm sandbag rows. So this is where we grab a corner of our sandbag, nice foot hinge, make a soft bend in the knee, elbow up and control down. We're going to do 10 on one side and swap. If the sandbag is a little bit heavy for single arm rows, we can grab it with both hands and go for those. We're going to do 10 on each arm or 20 in total, you can scale those reps down as well. Guys, good luck. Don't forget to put your scores on me on the whiteboard. If you have any questions, please ask. Have fun.